What's up, this your boy CJ Goodfella back with the boxing clinic. Um, going for the five videos today. This will be the fourth one I upload. And you know, Oscar De La Hoya said that you know Bernard Hopkins did better than Andre Ward did versus Ar versus Sergey Kovalev, and that was complete horseshit. <clears throat> A lot of people are speculating Oscar's back on that white girl again. Um, that was just crazy as fuck. Uh, Andre Ward did worlds better, but you got to give it to Hopkins. For even surviving with that beast Kovalev at the age of 50 years old. And he took the risk and showed that he never ducked anybody in his career. He longed, he longed and waited for that Roy Jones rematch. The money was never right between the two. They both thought they were entitled to more money. Um, and the rematch happened down the road, but that shit don't even count how old they was. But um, absolutely, Bernard didn't do better than Ward. I thought Ward won by one or two points. Um, versus Kovalev, and I think Bernard just mailed it in, but he's an old man, he just wanted to survival mode, um, but you know, it's, it's still a great feat that he did, you know, survive in that weight class with that useful fighter and Sergey Kovalev with that much power, and now we transition to talk about, you know, Bernard Hopkins' new trainer that I just really found about today, that was John David Jackson, um, a lot of people haven't been talking about it, uh, it really caught me off guard, um, that, you know, he's been knowing John for a while, and you know, John just beat him be him as Sergey Kovalev's trainer, and Nazim, I guess, is having some health issues. So I guess I'm guessing he switched over to John David Jackson for his last hurrah. Um, I haven't heard anything from Nazim. Maybe Nazim is healthy enough to take the fight. He just didn't feel comfortable with him. Um, I think Nazim has been there for the majority of his career as a you know assistant corner man or a bunder some guy you guys used to train with. Um, but you know. It's sad to see that they party ways like this. If it's for health reasons, I have no issue with it. Um, John David Jackson is an excellent trainer from training my friend Alan Green to training Kovalev to training some hot shot fighters, Chris Algieri. Um, he's definitely a hot name in the sport. Um, he has some strong opinions, you know, and when he's defeated, he, he's, he takes it uh, pretty much hard and comes up with excuses, but he's an excellent trainer at the end of the day and um, one of the good guys in boxing. Good luck, Bernard. We gone.